Hey guys, today I'm here and I'm going to be showing you how to get a custom thumbnail for your videos. Um, this also works if you want to put it for channel art. Let's get started. So, the first thing you're going to need is you're going to need your background for your uh, thumbnail. Next, what you can do is you can just search up Minecraft uh, logo. And then uh, you just find that. And then you just go to your images. And then you download something that you like. Preferably that one because it uh or this one they have um it's transparent so it doesn't have like a black background or something something like these two um after that you're going to put both of those into your downloads or on your desktop or something next you're going to need to make sure that your account is verified right here and if it isn't you're just going to click the button that says verify and then they're going to ask you for like a little pop up and it's going to be like you know they need your phone number and they need your uh your gmail and the country that you're in so they can send it to you next your features uh... they need to be in like your channel it needs to be good standing or even more so yeah now that that's done we're gonna get these so you're just gonna save the link and that's what you don't want you don't want the url so what you want to do is you want to click on image and then you want to save the image as and then we're just gonna name it um, our tutorial and then it's going to be tutorial dot uh, jpeg and uh, no so I'm just going to name it tutorial one dot jpeg and then you're going to get this you're just going to leave that right there now you're going to go and uh, type in uh, pixel editor or you can go down into my link in the description below now that we're here, it um, it'll usually take you to another screen. You're gonna pick the editor version, which is like the first one. It has like a little butterfly like that. Um, the rest are just kind of like mess around ones that are in beta or something. So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna rename it. That's this part is optional. I'm just gonna name this um, uh, tutorial. Now what you need to do for presence, you need to set this all the way down to 720p, 480p, or 1080p. For mine it's 720. Now you're just going to click OK. So now you have this. What you're going to do is you're going to go to File, open your image. You want this to be your background image that you just now got. And we're going to try to find it. It's right here. So here we have this. This is actually what we're going to be working with. You're going to be working with this. And what you want to do is you want to kind of zoom it out. See how that's like gray? What you want to do is you want to uh, you want to go to edit and you want to do free transform. Now what you want to do is you want to kind of try to drag it to the middle, and then when you want to just try to uh, make it bigger. Now you're going to try to center it and then drag this like that. Just a little bit like that. Yes, you want to apply your changes. Uh, wait, one little sliver is still showing. And this is like the freeway. It doesn't. It looks uh, decently professional. It's uh, very easy to do. You just have to get this part centered right, and then you're pretty much set. So yeah, you're gonna save your changes. Now you have your changes saved. And what you want to do is go and go file open image and then you want to find say the minecraft logo that you have so this one is my minecraft logo right here and then it's going to pop up remember you're going to just drag this in like that and then it'll you need to x this out now what we want to do is we want to make this a little bit smaller so what we're going to do is we're going to edit free transform and we want to make it just a little bit smaller so we want to make this probably somewhere like that and you want to kind of try to drag it up to make it look good then we're going to put it up to the top try to center this out now that you're done with this you're going to yes apply your changes so now you have that that is pretty big though um, free transform that looks a lot better 
Now that you have this, whoa. Nice. All right, next what you wanna do is you wanna uh, click off and save it. So here it is, it's saved and everything. Now you're gonna go to file, open image, and we're gonna find, um, uh, actually no, you're gonna go to this A button right here, and we're just gonna click somewhere and this is where we want the text to be so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna type this in for um, hmm. I wanna put in um, how to get to wait, too many uh, items and then for 1.7.10 because this is not actually released but it will be shortly after this so 1.7.10 and then we're going to go um, let's see non -forge. then you're just going to go non forge so we're going to do forge and then um, we could probably like do this and just say like you know easy and then do that now what we're gonna do is right here we're going to click enter like that and then we're gonna center it by clicking that button now we're gonna drag this like this I want the size to be probably um, 80 yeah that's decent and then the color we're just gonna put it as something like red now what we're gonna try to do is we're gonna try actually we need to move this oh no that's a little bit too big let's try to put it at um, 65 yeah there we go uh, now we're gonna try to find like what we want it to be written in So I'm going to go down here and we're just going to pick something. Actually, before we do this, we want to put this in. Like that. And then boom, it's uh, finished. We're just going to recenter it again. And let's actually just put it to 70. Yeah, there we go. That looks a lot better. So now we have this, and we're just going to center it a little bit better. Like that. Okay. Now, I'm pretty much done, but if you want to, you can add in, like, more images. So I'm just going to add in, say, this guy. And then what you're going to do is you're going to drag him behind how to get the too many items or whatever you drew it for. So he actually goes behind it. Um, and then you're just going to go to uh, your cursor again. And then we're going to put this back. And then we're going to go to the layer zero copy. And I'm going to put him like this. Hmm. Center that a little bit better. Then we're going to add another one of me, but he's going to be facing this way. And we're going to put him like this. And he's not behind it, so we need to do that. And we need to click on it. And then we need to move him. And then, um, yeah, boom. Now if we want to, we can like do something probably like that. And then we can go in here. And we can get a creeper or something, but I'm not going to do that. I'm really pushing for time right now. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to File, Save, and then put your however you want. It depends on how big your file size one is going to be. And we're just going to name this Tutorial 1. Fine. Tutorial 10. There. So now it's saved. You can go ahead and X out of this. And, uh, yeah, you guys are done. So please, if this helped you, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Um, put any comments down in the description if you're having